Out TV. It's your favorite friend out here, D Faith. What's going on? I hope all is well. So today I am in my bathroom and I am doing like a get ready with me chit chat type situation. I wanted to talk to you guys and let y'all know where I've been, what is to come on my channel, and what things I have planned. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to be braiding up this hair for the night so tomorrow when i record you know my hair can be popping and this hair is by maxine hair from aliexpress and this is the brazilian water wave hair and every night i braid it up so let's get started i don't know if a lot of you guys knew why i have not been uploading but i had decided to take a break because um it's been i honestly feel like oh, i honestly feel like i have been doing youtube for two years and i'm ready to start having better quality so <laughs> So y'all know, this is how much I use, one pump. So, you know, I just felt like I needed to have better quality in my videos. I want more for myself, just ready to improve my work and everything. So I decided to take a break and honestly, you guys, I was not planning on taking the break as long as I did. It did not um, go as planned, which guess what? Life never goes as planned, you know what I mean? Y'all should know if you have been watching me that I've done like little vlogs to kind of keep y'all updated on what's been going on with me and stuff like that. And even within that, I didn't show too much. I just wanted to come on here and talk to you guys and, you know, let y'all know what's going on with the faith. What's, you know, what's the 411? What's the tea, you know? Because I feel like every single time I come out of a break, I always kind of do an update type situation where I tell you guys what's going on, what's the tea and all that jazz. But I feel like now I want to get more closer to you guys because that was one of my um, New Year's resolutions. So, you know, kind of being more open. So, yeah. So, um... So I did end up going back to school, you guys. So I did take a semester off. Um, I don't know if some of you guys knew that, but yes, I did take a semester off and now I'm still in community college, but I am at a different campus. And to be honest with you guys, I am in love with this new campus. I have actually been thinking about changing my major and y'all know that I from some of my blogs that I fell in love with YouTube and not just you know just creating content for you guys the editing process the process that a lot of people don't like and so I've been wanting to go to school for that so now i'm taking this digital media class and um so far i'm on my second project in the class and i love this class so much you guys like i have never loved a class um since i can't even think okay <laughs> because i i'm not a huge fan of school I'm the type of person where I like life lessons. I like learning self-taught. That's my thing. I don't know if it's because I'm an only child. I don't know what it is. But, you know. So, I really, really love this class, you guys. 
down. So before we did a photo board where we had to take different shots and different angles, and now we're doing a sound story. So if you don't know what a sound story is, I'm gonna make it real quick because I wanna talk about a lot of other things while I'm doing my braids. But a sound story basically is we create a story and it's basically off of sound. So it's basically you're recording your voice or you having somebody else recording their voice for the story and you have different sound effects to make the story come to life. And oh my gosh, like I'm just so in love with this class. I love my professor. I love like the environment. Like it's just like, OMG, I love it. But but yeah, so I do want to further that into going into a um art school for that i don't decide to stay there and continue my major with that i have been looking into the art institute uh, i had a friend who went there the pennsylvania location and she went for like fashion and something else and she really liked it there so um the one that i want to go to i feel like such a better fit it's a new beginning because honestly at this point you guys i'm so ready for a new beginning in my life i'm just so ready to just start my new life but i know it's coming soon i just have to be a little bit more patient so yeah that's that i'm still working at the same job <laughs> i'm just basically trying to um, take myself more seriously, take, you know, my dream, my goals more seriously so I can live my dream one day. Like, you know what I mean? I, when I look at, you know, like Latoya Forever, I, I see women, I, I, when I look at the Levine life, Gay Bay TV, like, I'm just like, yo, I want to be, like, you know what I mean? Like, one day I want to be like that. Even, like, when I see, cele like, for real celebrities, like, they work so hard to give their family the best you know be able to buy their parents a house and a car and buy it you know just that's what i want for myself i love how you know latoya is like her her friends and family they got their own channel they doing their own thing like and it's a lot of youtubers and successful people who had that and that's what i want for myself like i want better than what i have now like, i find that my life is terrible, completely terrible. But I do want better for myself. And I want better for my family. I want better for my friends. And when I get married and start a family, that's what I want. Like, camera shut off while I was talking. So, yeah. But basically, what I was saying was, like, I don't want to settle. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to just settle for anything. I don't want it to be 30, 40 years later and I'm at a job that I hate and I'm just like, yo, I could have done so much more. I have so much talent, especially since I have a passion for, you know, doing video. Like, a lot of people don't have that type of passion. A lot of people don't have the dedication and the drive and the realize the hard work that it comes into creating video, not just being a YouTube personality or a blogger or whatever. Like, you know, it's a lot of work. Like, it's a lot that goes into it, you know what I mean? And, like, I want to be able to have my family proud of me. I want to be able to be able to one day get my parents a house. Like, I want to be able to have better for me and my family. You know, my genuine friends that I care about. I want them to be able to win too. I wanna show them, I wanna show my younger cousins, like, you know, that I'm a good example for them. I just don't want to settle. Like my parents always taught me, don't be at a job that you hate, that you're gonna be hating for the rest of your life. Like, you know, don't settle. You deserve so much more. Have a career that you love, that you know years later you're going to be like, Zach, I love what I do. Like, I made a difference in what I do. Like, you know, 
and that's how I feel about YouTube. Like, it's not about my numbers. Like, yeah, I want my numbers to go high because if my numbers go high, that means more people are re are are watching. That means more people that I'm inspiring, helping out. But it's not about necessarily the money. It's the fact that I'm able to build my brand to have this platform to do greater work that you know i love to do like i love doing hair things i'm working on with that um you know just doing advice i love when y'all email me for advice and i'm able to reach you guys because like i say that is basically the main reason why i started a channel you know what i'm saying so you know i just I just really love and want to keep on going and by the time the video's up, you will see that I have a new banner, um, I have new pictures on Instagram, like I really, I have a new profile picture, like I'm really trying to be serious with this, you guys, like, and to be honest, this is like literally the first thing that I have ever stuck out and been completely serious about and it's like... I want to keep going like you know what I mean I don't want to one day just fall off of the face of the earth and y'all don't know where I'm at like you know I want to I don't know but but yeah you guys like it's just so much that I'm working on I just can't wait to share with you guys like I'm trying to tell you like I feel like this year 2017 is grind time like time to get stuff done so when 2018 come it's nothing but just my hard work paying off like everybody gets to see my hard work paying off and like really anything that you have a dream for and a passion whether if it's makeup hair having a cooking show whatever it is like literally you need stuff out on faith and we need hard work like if you want to continue to be successful and you know, really have things go your way. Like, hard work, man. Nothing comes easy. Like, nothing. Nothing that's worth it, I should say. Comes easy. Like, you know? Nothing. I don't care what nobody tells you. You talk to one of the most successful people in the world. One of the most wealthiest people in the world. They'll tell you. Your favorite YouTubers. Like, they will tell you successfully. They will say all the time. Like, it's nothing but faith and all work for real consistency consistency goes with hard work i really want my subscribers to be able to realize that you know they work so much more they are king and queens and they shouldn't settle for nothing like they shouldn't settle for working for somebody they shouldn't settle for jobs that they hate they shouldn't settle with people who don't treat them right they deserve the best of the best and more like they deserve the world and more and you know, I'm just so excited to grow with you guys and for me to create more content for you guys. You know, us connecting, us being a family. I'm pretty much done, as you can see. But I'm about to just spray some water on it a little bit more and then put my bonnet on. And that's pretty it, you guys. If you want to see the finished look, make sure you go watch my review on this hair so you can see how it came out when I took the braids out. And I love you guys. I gave you nothing but peace, love, and positivity. You already know what it is. And I will talk to you in the next one. Love you guys. I need to go get my nails done. I'm going to get it done. I promise. I promise. They look hella ratchet. That's a woman. When you are broken, you make a choice.